Yo, what's up, guys? It's Spooky, and today I'm making a video on a free web GUI ghost client. So, yeah, let's get into it. Alright guys, so today we're going to be showcasing a free web GUI ghost client, so I do think it's a pretty good alternative to drip light, but you can't really expect it to be undetectable since it's free. So credit to this guy, I don't know how to pronounce his name, but he is the creator. And big thanks to my friend Rip Your Kid because he's the one that told me about this ghost client, and I was like, oh that's cool, I'm going to make a video on it. So yeah, this is the GitHub link, I'll leave it in the description below, and uh, obviously if you want to download it. It will be in the link in the description and before you actually run the ghost client you have to follow all the instructions down here so make sure you follow the instructions and the change log is also on the website so yeah let's get into it alright guys so once you have downloaded the RAR file extract it onto your desktop and it's gonna be a file like this so all you need to do is you gotta open it and you don't need to worry about anything else just double click on the injector okay so it's gonna open this up and it should open another window up in a second so you just gotta wait and right here it's gonna say Zyclone and then detect the version you're on and all you gotta click on is load and it'll say success and now you just gotta copy this and put it in your browser or on your phone so I'm gonna do it on my, on my browser real quick so basically this cheat is hosted off your local IP so here it is I'm currently on the web GUI where you can control all the settings and stuff so you know you can put your CPS and stuff the aimbot is basically aim assist um, there we go and honestly I, I feel like the aim assist is pretty cool because I never seen an aim assist like this you know yaw and pitch I wish it was like more simplistic like horizontal and wide but I'm assuming Okay, it does have tooltips, so this is horizontal smoothing. And they do have reach as well. And, uh, yeah, so. I'm just. Okay. Okay, I see how it is now. So it can. It goes up to four block, basically. I get it, okay. So. Well, let's try something like. Uh. Like this. And I'm assuming that this is the Minecraft item number. Yeah. So. Um, enable, enable. These are the key binds. You can change it, of course, right here. You got player list, which is pretty interesting. You can put friends. And there's visual hacks as well. Name tags, brightness, and fake lag, which is pretty interesting. I haven't seen that in uh, Ghost Client. They do have throw pop, which is very nice. Now the velocity is kind of weird because I don't, I don't, I don't really understand how it works, honestly. Like it's being multiplied; it's not like your standard velocity, so it's kind of confusing at times. And let's close this, and it does show a watermark, which is pretty cool. I wish you can disable it because my toggle sprint is in the way, so I'm gonna disable that real quick for well, the one that are bothered. But they do have reach. I'm testing on an NPC model right now. Probably not the best idea. One, two, three, four. And if I disable the reach, let's see, where is it? X. Okay, so it's X. One, two, three. Yeah, I don't think it's very accurate. I'm gonna go test it on like an actual server, and I'll be back. Okay guys, so I'm currently in Arcane, and as you guys can see, I'm currently in the spawn, and there's the aim assist. So it does kind of randomize and have its own randomization, which is pretty good. So it kind of aims for the center of the body right there. So, let's see. Goes to the head, so like, yeah, like around the chest area, you know? And, uh, my FOV is kind of big, so it, look, it's try to, try to force it to grab over there, so... There we go, there's the auto clicker. I don't have the CPS mod on, but uh, let's see how we do. This is the only game that I'm going to play because I'm trying to keep this video short and sweet for you guys. Because if it's too long, it, the render take too long, so yeah. Alright, let's see. 
Hopefully this guy can put up a good fight and not quick drop. But uh, holy crap, I can already feel that my velocity is reduced by a lot. And this guy probably already notices that. Alright, GG. Okay guys, so that's gonna be it for the video guys. Um, big thanks to the creator of this client. You know, not a lot of people are willing to make free clients nowadays, cause... You know, for, I, I kinda understand, I guess. But anyways, make sure to drop a like and stuff, and subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next video, bye.